welcome back to a new League of Legends Wild Rift video. Well, we will get the alpha in June. Uh, so there is some update from the developers and I will explain everything in this video. So let's go into it. First of all, we will have the map and there is a blue side and there is a red side and uh, there is the lens, I will explain all the lens later and as you can see we are spawning and um, here is the blue team and the red team now we will explain the map so there is uh, top lane, mid lane and bottom lane as bottom lane having Uh, the top lane champions must be tanker or kind of fighter and the mid lane uh, mid lane is very like uh, it can be a fighter as well as it can be a mage so it depends on the composition of the opponent as well as your team and you guys may confused about the uh, which is the bottom side and which is the top side and uh, let me let me explain it if you are in blue team or if you are in red team the left of your hand the left of your hand will be the top side and the right of your hand will be the bottom side no matter which uh, team in you uh, you may be in blue side as well as you may be in red side finding match or uh, just play a game and uh, we can see the normal mode and as well as the cop versus ai mode uh, so there will be a rank and uh, there will be normal mode and there will be as well as the training and as well as a blind pick and uh, this is interesting uh, here they give the blind pick we in the pc we actually don't have that option uh, blind pick means actually you will just search for a game either rank or normal whatever whatever game it is but it will uh, it will show up and the uh, you will join the queue as well as you will get a game and uh, they will show up the if it is rank or if it is normal so as you can choose if you will play or you can just uh, exit or about the game and i will give them a big thumbs up uh, for this game mode um in the normal game mode we will have some interesting game mode like arf actually arf actually means the ultra rapid fire and um, there will be some one for all one for all means uh, everyone have the same champion and the opponent they also have the same champion so 5v5 same same champion so that's an interesting game so in this training section you will have some interesting things like uh, you can training um, you can take training in different types of things uh, so um, i especially i like these things a lot because uh, for the uh, new player who didn't even pl played in the pc version of league of legend uh, they might be uh, in trouble and uh, this is very good for them as uh, as this tutorial part and uh, so this is a, a very good job by riot and as you can see uh, there is a reward i i mean there is a chest and this chest actually contains skin shards uh, if you uh, played league of legends pc you can but you don't know uh, this chest uh, you need a key and the key will be given by uh, given by riot i mean given by free uh, so the, uh, you have to open the chest with the key um, and 
the chest contain skin shot so uh, if you want a skin uh, there need three skin shots in pc and uh, it might be different here there may be two either uh, the chest may be contain may other different things like emoji and and other uh, keys and uh, uh, other different icons oh, it depend it depends on your luck actually but mainly the chest actually contain the skin shots uh, so uh, we don't have much details about it now so later i will um, explain everything when we have some other details in the next part we have the interface of uh, main league of legend uh, matchmaking the champion select well in this champion select section you can uh, we can see there are not many champions shown actually this is for the region uh, they just uh, lock in the fighter section if uh, they lock in the all section man all champions uh, then all the champions will be shown so this is only the fighter uh, so there are some few champions uh, those are fighters uh, is been shown here and if if you know what are the other section a fighter to the next is the tank and to the next of tank is mage and to the next of the mage there is assassin and to the next of the assassin there is support as well as uh, the last section will be the marksman or adc adc means for attack damage carry and there is also a all section out there above the runes uh, there you can see there is the passive of a champion if you select a pass champion so that will have the passive what it has passive you can show it there as you can see there will be seven spells out there and uh, there uh, th these spells are most of the most of them will be similar to the pc but uh, as the developer said uh, the emit will work a bit different and uh, uh, we'll update you later what is the difference and um, uh, actually this is how it works i will make a video about that so guys stay tuned i will and get some update again to the right of the runes there will be spells and uh, you can have the two summary spells and here as you can see there is ignite and there is flash so we let me so coming up, coming up next is actually the runes and the runes actually you can see the keystone of a rune actually what does this mean the keystone means this is the primary rune and the keystone actually the secondary rune so the secondary runes actually depends on your champion and the champion you are uh, using and as well as the opponents the this runes also depends on opponents which type of runes is applicable for your opponents and um, as you can see uh, this is array and the concord and the other fleet work uh, fleet footwork i guess so there there are some variation in runes and you guys have to be very careful about that as the runes is very much important for total game if you choose the rune perfectly you can win the game uh, this is the minor things but uh, this may affect so you guys keep an eye on my channel i will give the all the updates about the runes as you can see there are lots of variation on the runes and uh, there are lots of different categories so when we will have some updates i will let you know everything about it and uh, let me know in the comment section if you want the indi individual runes and how they work and how they how they how you have to use it uh, let me know in the comment section if you want a video about runes so so guys today's video is all about the things you have to know before you go into the rift i mean before you go into the wild rift the things you must have to know I'll just uh, let I just tried my best to explain this 
so hope you guys enjoyed and uh, let me know in the comment section what type of video you want so see you guys in the next video hope you guys enjoyed